Good morning, everyone. My name is Bhavya Jha, and I am a student of 11C. Today, we are going to perform a biology practical, that is, dissection of a hibiscus flower. So, for this experiment, we are going to use a regulatory tool, which are there in the dissection box, and our freshly plucked hibiscus flower. The hibiscus flower is also known as Rosa sinensis, or China rose, which belongs to the family of Malkasi. This plant has adventitious root and has back leaves and free lateral stipula. Has over type of lamina and reticulated venation. It is an actinomorphic flower, monodiphyllosis, cohesion, exile placentation, and this flower also has medicinal uses. Now in this experiment, first of all, we are going to remove the sepals, which is the green part of the flower. After when we remove the sepals, we are going to remove the colored part of the flower. Yes, the petals. So after when we detach the petals from the flower, we are going to split open the style of the flower. So this is the area that we are going to dissect to detach the ovary from the style. After that, when we get the ovary which is here, we are going to needle that area to get the numerous ovules. And then our dissection of the hibiscus flower will be completed. So let us start. First is the removal of the sepals from the flower. So, we are going to remove the sepals from the flower. Be very careful while doing this. Now after when you are done with this part, you are going to remove the petals which is the colored part of the flower. Be very careful and slow. Now, we are going to use a needle to dissect this area. So, let us do that. So, now we are going to dissect the style of the flower to get the ovary. Be very careful while doing this. This is the male part of the flower which contains the pollen. And yes, we have divided the style into two parts. Now we are going to remove this area to get the ovary.
This is the ovary that we have got. Now when we are going to see this ovary, we are now going to dissect this to get the ovules. Just remove the extra parts which are here. This is the ovary. Now we are going to dissect this to get the ovules. I can see numerous ovules now. These are the ovules. So, this was the ovary and these are the ovules. These were the sepals, the petals, the style and the pollen. With this, we have completed the dissection of a hibiscus flower. Hope you liked my experiment. Thank you so much.